Well, it's an understatement. CJ uh, CJ had it going in the fourth. He was, um, uh, especially after the start he had, I think he miss, missed his first seven shots, but he um, he showed um, shows what he made of. He came in, never lost confidence, uh, took the shots that were there, and got us over the hump. So, you know, obviously he's the story of the night. Um, thought our production from the center spot was terrific, uh, both Ennis and, and Nurk. Uh, from a scoring standpoint and from a rebounding standpoint, we're very effective. Um, I thought Damien did a very, very nice job of managing the game. Fair to say that uh, a lot of NBA players that might miss seven shots and not go on the way he was able to get through that. Well, I think from I mean, obviously you'll ask him, but I, I think he was confident that the looks he had in the first half were all good looks, and you know he's too good of a player, too good of a shooter. Um, to not take the next one. So um, I didn't expect him to go on a roll, but I certainly expected him to make some more shots. And then uh, late in the second half, it was a tight game. How were you eventually able to just you know, put some distance? Uh, well, defensively, I thought we did a better job rebounding, uh, forced some miss, and, and rebound the ball. That, you know, they, Harold really had a big impact on the game. His, his energy, his rebounding kind of kept him in the game. So we. I thought we kept that under control a little bit better, and then obviously CJ, uh, CJ at the offensive end. Uh, I mean, I was glad he hit it. I don't know if that that turned the tide or not, but um, it was good. <laughs> I think it was good just from a mental standpoint to hit it. I I, I didn't know if that would be the one that got it going, but um, it's good to end the half in that. Just, you know, with his start, I didn't, you know, just kind of tease him about his start and finishing like that. The way this uh, Western Conference game like this and the way the standings are, uh, how, how significant are these wins in these games? They're all significant. No, no matter who you're playing, every game, every game matters now. You know, it's, we always say the games in November and December matter, uh, which they do, but uh, I think it's these games now with a tight race, uh, you know, you can slide. Uh, Standings. If you lose a couple, you can move up. If you win a couple, so um, and I think everybody kind of appreciates that. You mentioned Ennis and Nurk. How did they complement each other? Well, uh, different styles. Uh, you know, Nurk. Uh, we use him as a passer a lot. Uh, don't post him up much, but he's really good in the pick and roll. And um, you know, defensively, he's the, he's been the anchor for us defensively. Uh, Ennis is you know a, a go-to scorer in the with that second unit. He creates double teams. Um, he's an effective scorer. Gets to the line, and I think he's getting better defensively.